And now is the time, if ever there was one, for us to care selflessly about one another. I don't have the answers, but I do know we must plot, we must plan, we must strategize, organize, and mobilize. President Barack Obama famously said, change will not come if we wait for some other person or some other time. We are the ones we've been waiting for. We are the change that we seek. But how do we make that change happen? How do we take a good idea for addressing climate change, combating racial justice, or lifting up our fellow humans from the spark of a good idea to implementation and impact? How do we convert our passion into progress? How do we convert protest into impact? That is what we'll cover in Solving Public Problems, part of the Big Ideas course series at NYU. Hello, I'm NYU professor Bessimo Novak, and I'm delighted to accompany you on this exploration as we learn together how to take advantage of new technology, data, and innovation to pursue social justice. To help you become, as Gandhi said, the change that you seek, we will spend the next seven weeks learning both quantitative and qualitative methods for solving public problems, not in theory, but in real world practice. We will learn to define and solve problems, to implement those solutions, and together to measure what works. Not by the yardstick of our own ambition, but by the measure of how we strengthen our communities. Not by how far we advance ourselves, but by how far we lift up the lives of others. Not by how much we make, by how much we deepen and safeguard our democracy. We will learn not only how to create efficient and effective solutions to our challenges, but how to create equitable and legitimate ways to tackle our hardest problems by designing and implementing solutions with the very people and communities we seek to help. These lectures are accompanied by readings, exercises, and self-assessments, as well as a wonderful series of interviews with leading change makers those inspiring individuals getting into good trouble from the public sector and academia, nonprofits, philanthropies, and companies. It is their deeds, as much as my words, which will illuminate the pathway for doing well by doing good. I can't wait to learn together. Thanks.